In this video, I'll show you how to fix the issue with Windows File Explorer where it keeps crashing. Now, unfortunately, there is no one magic solution that will work for everyone, so you will need to go through each of these steps to find the solution that works for you. So the very first thing we need to do is head over to our start menu and we're just going to search for settings and then head over to the settings application. From the left hand side, select system inside of display and you need to come down to this scale option here and just make sure this is set to the recommended number. So for me, that's going to be 150%. Just make sure whatever option you select here, it has this recommended text by it. And once we've selected this option, it's also a good idea to come down to Windows Update on the left and then just press this check for updates button to ensure we are running the latest version of Windows. So once you've installed any pending updates inside of here, we can close out of the settings window and we're next gonna come over to our start menu, search for task manager, and then just head over to the task manager window. Inside of here, you need to locate Windows Explorer from this list of processes and we're simply gonna right click on Windows Explorer and you need to select restart. We can then close out of this window and check to see if that's fixed the issue. Otherwise, what you'll need to do is come back over to the start menu, search for CMD, and then right click on the command prompt and run this as administrator. Inside of this window, we're just going to type in SFC space slash, scan now, and then hit enter. And this will perform a scan on our computer just to ensure all of our files are in order and nothing's damaged or missing. So you'll need to wait for this verification process to get to 100% and then we can close out of this window. And the next thing you'll need to do is head back over to the start menu, search for control panel and then head over to the control panel application. At the top here, next to view by, just make sure this is set to large icons and then come over to file explorer options. So first thing we need to do is where it says open file explorer 2, we're just gonna select from this drop down this PC and then press apply and okay to save these changes. Then you need to come back inside of File Explorer options and we're gonna come down to the bottom here and you need to press this clear button to clear all of our File Explorer cache and it won't give you any confirmation message or anything. So just by pressing this button, that will have cleared all of your cache. So we can press okay to head out of here. And now if that's still not fixed the issue, the very last thing we can do is come over to our start menu and search for PowerShell and then just right click on Windows PowerShell here and run this as administrator. Now there is a command that I have saved in this notepad over here and I'll leave this in the video description for you guys. So you simply need to come and copy this command and we're gonna come back to the terminal and then just paste this inside of here and hit enter. Now this command won't work on all operating systems. So it just depends what version of Windows you are using. And once you've ran this command, we can close out of this window. And hopefully by now that should have fixed any issues you're having with Windows File Explorer crashing. Now, if this video did help you, then please consider dropping a like and subscribing. Until next time.